Hey guys, uh, it's Robert, and um, today is my last full day in Singapore. Wow, um, I'm not sure where the time has gone. It's been it's flown by so 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 fast. Um, it's sad. Today's a sad day for me. Um, I'm excited, and I'll tell you why in a little bit. But I'm I'm also sad to be leaving Singapore and leaving um, a lot of the wonderful people that I've met here behind. Um, to all of you guys here in Singapore that have really just opened your arms up to me, thank you, thank you, thank you. You introduced me to some of the best experiences of my life, and I'm not, I'm not just saying that to be saying it. I, I really mean it. Um, you've opened me up to new horizons. You've shown me a new culture, which I love. Um, and of course, you introduced me to Singaporean cuisine. Yeah, uh, so I will miss the chicken rice. I will miss the laksa. I will miss the duck rice. I will miss the steamboat and all the other food that comes with being in Singapore, of course. Um, but yeah, so sincerely, um, to all of my friends that I met here who were also traveling and are not natives of Singapore, um, thank you guys for being amazing friends on this journey with me. Um, again, you guys have exposed me to all of your cultures a little bit, and for that I'm very thankful. Um, so uh, I also, I really want to take this time too, I want to say thank you um, to my friends and family back in the U.S. Thank you guys. Um, honestly, without a lot of your all's uh, encouragement, I don't know if I would have been as likely to come here. So um, I really owe um, some gratitude toward uh, you guys back home, especially my mom. Uh, my mom and dad, actually, um, they kind of really encouraged me to take this opportunity. Um, you know, just before I get settled in life, um, they were basically like, when's the next time you're going to be able to travel essentially for free? So, um, you know, thank you guys for definitely encouraging me to <laughs> take this opportunity because, uh, man, I would have regretted it had I not. And I think, I think maybe that's the worst feeling is, um, I realized on this trip that, um, it's probably not so much the opportunities that we, or I should back up. It's not so much things that we fail at that we regret as much as chances that we don't take. Um, so I'm really, really thankful that, you know, I've jumped over here to Singapore with a plane ticket and a leap of faith, um, because it turned out to be a really good experience for me. Um, so, uh, I told you guys, um, I'm a little bit excited too, because I am headed to Bangkok! Uh, so yeah, I will be heading to, uh, Thailand, uh, tomorrow morning. And um, I will be there for one to three months. Um, so it depends on how work goes and everything uh, to f figure out, get a feel for how long I actually really want to stay. But I'm super excited. I've been Googling images of all the food. The food there looks fantastic. Um, yeah, funny, huh? I'm going there for a modeling contract and the first thing I'm excited about is the food. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> so... Um, yeah, uh, I got a couple friends that are already there and have told me some really great things. And a lot of people that I'm friends with have already been there themselves. And they told me that I'm going to have a great time. So I'm super excited. I can't wait to see some of the temples. I really want to go to like the canals uh, that they have there. They sometimes refer to it as the Venice of Asia. Although that might be a stretch, but we'll see. We'll see. The floating markets. Um, so yeah, super excited about that. Um, after Thailand? I don't know. Um, I'm thinking that I'm probably going back to the U.S., which I'll also be very excited about um, because assuming that I stay for six, for three months, it'll be six months that I've been out of the country. So um, I'm super stoked to uh, get back to the U.S. after Thailand. But um, yeah, so we'll see what's coming next. Um, so I guess my next video update that I give you guys will be coming from Bangkok. Um, so by the way, in my last video, I was talking about how crazy hot it is here in Singapore. I just looked at the weather in Bangkok and it was 40 degrees Celsius. And for my friends in the US who have no idea what that means, 
it's over 100 degrees Fahrenheit right now, so it's about to get real. Um, but aside from that, what can I say? I'm going to Thailand. So catch you guys later. Um, love you, miss you, and see where the wind takes me again. All right, ciao, guys.